There we go. That's what Father likes. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Cube Draft here. I have Matthew Elk Tears on the line. Hello! And we're going to be doing another Vintage Cube Draft together. Or how do you want to do it? You want to just do the same alternating thing we're doing? All the way from New York City. New York City? That's like the Pace Picante ad, you know? Live from New York. It's Monday afternoon. He's right. Well, it's... On Frank Lepore's stream. What time does afternoon end, do you think? Um, I would say 6 p.m. Oh, so we got 10 minutes of afternoon left. Yeah. 10 afternoon minutes. Right? Or is it 5 p.m.? I just work here, man. I'm sorry. Well, chat, what do you think? When does afternoon end, chat? And YouTube YouTube viewers, let us know when the afternoon ends. Cooking some dinner, got the famous Frank show playing. Nice. Unfortunately, unlike YouTube, you can't watch at 1.5 speed. What are you cooking for dinner? Turnips. Quacker says 5 p.m. Are it's you? More QA, says can, six. can you answer my question about how we're going to do this draft? What, what's the question? What's our What's our format here? Are we just going to do the alternating picks again? I mean, is there something else you want to try? No, I'm just curious, man. If you have I an idea. Should we do blind picks? That seems hard. That seems is, hard to right? do, yeah. I mean, I could just cover the screen. But then how would you see the picks? No, I'll cover I'll cover the window where you see the picks. I guess we could both do that. It's real honor system though. I don't know if I trust you, I'll mean, be honest. You I mean, how much do you trust me here? That's what I'm saying. Can you trust me as far as you can throw me? Uh, I would trust you less than that distance. Well, here. Wait, Do no. Do you actually want to try this? Th to throw you? No, I think I'm I good. think you have to get out of this, and we need to, like, talk about it for a second. Or is it too late? I think it's I think it's a whole to-do. Okay, we won't do it. Let's oh, just do no, it's also, it's not possible, again. because, like... I don't know, I'm trying to think, because, like... I would just tape up the part of your screen where... I, or, hey, here's the thing. No, you'd you have to tell me what me, card can... to pick. Wait, listen to this. You could put a window over. Oh, you, right, because I, I can't. You pick would have. You would still have to tell me what card to pick, right. so I yeah, would have to true. see there all of go. the cards to pick them. Well, here, you're be like, go grab Felipe and bring him in here. He be here. <laughs> you're like, take the ancestral recall, and I'll be like, okay, hold on, I have to look for. Oh, I see this entire pack. He could be my avatar. <laughs> hmm. That being said, this queue has taken a little bit to fire. It's taken a while. Dare I say you might want to restart the YouTube video. Pick one tendrils, pick two Rafellas. No, we're we're too deep into it now. We got seven of eight already. Alright. It's all you. Okay. Is it? You got first I got first pick last time, I thought. I went first, then you went first, then I went first, or is it you went first, I went first, you went first? You went first the first draft. Right. Then oh, so I it's went. me again? No, it's you. All right. Uh, this is a pretty unexciting pack. It is pretty unexciting. Elspeth, maybe? Ugh. Okay. You don't like Elspeth? I mean, I kind of like straight-up counterspell. How about Faithless Looting? No. Anybody got time for that? This is a modern. <laughs> what about Gush? You don't like Goosh? Well, if you take Gush, you know what I'm going to try to force us into. I was trying to do that with Faithless Looting, my, my man. Do you think that's a Storm card? It's one mana to draw to. Yeah, man. All yeah, right, man. Right. Okay, do it. I'm down. I did it's it. your pick. Elspeth does not seem exciting. Okay. Well, this is... That didn't turn out as well as we thought. Um... I think it's... I like Sheldock here. Or we could take Bizarre and be hardcore animator. There's also Crater Hoof Behemoth right here, staring you right in your fat face. <sighs> How are you going to hate Crater Hoof? I hate Crater Hoof's fine. It's just a mono green And then this guy comes back? Sometimes. sometimes? What about this time right now? I want Sheldock. All right. I'm, not, I'm sorry. You, 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 don't have to apologize. you don't have to apologize. You don't have to apologize. You don't have to apologize. Oh, Demonic Tutor. <laughs> I'm going to take this Demonic Tutor. Oh, that's, yeah, I like that. I don't care what you like. That's what Father likes. That's, that's, 
<laughs> and remember, we can, even if we don't like Storm, we can just be like some sweet Grixis deck. I like Black Leaf Cliffs. I like uh, uh, Riffling Cloud Skate. I do like a There's Black a Leaf Cliffs. Nightmare, though. I think I think it is it lame to take Cliffs. No, I don't think it's lame at all. All right, take Cliffs. I just know it's one of the lamer. I mean, that cycle. It is, but it is what it, like it's it's there. It's like it's it's what you have, you know. Yeah. I actually, I, you probably want the Iron Mace, so I'm going to take Thief of Sanity because I think this card's bonkers in in Vintage Cube. Fair enough. For Iron the Mace. record, Chad, if it was my pick, I would have taken Iron Mace. So. I know you would have. What are you drinking, Frank? What's your beverage right now? I have water, but it's got like some uh, some black cherry. You got some Mio in there. I you got, got some Mio undies in there. I don't have Mio undies in there, unfortunately. Mio undies. When are you gonna get that uh, affiliation to the Let's Mio undies? Collab. Well, I don't think that exists. The, the Mio X. It's my pick, right? Oh yeah. Come on, do it. Ugh. All right. Do it. Grab them. Yeah. <sighs> Exciting. Just grab him. That was exciting. Oh, I meant Wall of Roots. <laughs> you picked the wrong one. I like Dark Dwellers here. I do too. For I mean, what? I could see like Demonic Splash Tutor. Yeah, we have Demonic Tutor and Looting so far, but like you obviously get a lot of good instants and sorceries here. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take Dark Dwellers. I'm not a big Bob fan. Like eventually, because you, you end up getting like five, a bunch of fives and six and stuff. Yeah, I, again, I think Bob is just like, it's one of those, it's a constructed card. Like, I'm playing Vintage Cube, I'm going to play like eight drops in my deck. Right, right I now. want to be able to Windmill Slam Emrakul with Through the Breach, and I don't want to die because of it. Well, this pack is uh, trash. It's poops, mixed scoops. Of the trashiest kind. I mean, I kind of just want to take Hex Mage to like cut cut black. Yeah, that's fine. I could also see taking Huntmaster because I think Huntmaster is a fine splash if we get a land for it or whatever, but. X Mage works. I don't know about fine splashes when we just took Nicol Bolas. Oh, is that right? It's triple black. See, sort of quick agreed with me. <sighs> Guys, I'm trying. I wanted Storm to happen. There were no Storm cards. Oh, Windswept Heath. We're not taking Windswept Teeth. Um, this is my pick, buddy. Oh, it is, right? But I want to hear your thoughts. I like I like Shriekmaw. I think Shriekmaw's fine. I do like Bells Unlock, but... Yeah. I like Shriekmaw better than Bells Unlock. Bells Unlock thoroughly unimpresses me. Same, and I don't like it. I want it to impress me. See, like, right here, I would have picked up a Stray Raging Ravine and then, like, splashed, like, Huntmaster or something off of it. Are you kidding me? Hi Hippie Spectre? Yeah, we'll take Hippie. All right, that's fine. The card, the card, uh... Oh. Choops. I like, a, I like Choops, yeah. This is my pick, right? Uh, no, right you now, picked the, the Hippie. The last one was mine. I yeah. Basically... All right, we're getting close to the two card. Oh, all right, well. I like Ophiomancer. Yeah, yeah take it. it's not really a... Not really okay, a I'll take Triumph here. And again, we're going to watch the last pack and see how many seconds are on the clock after it's taken. Zero into like wow i didn't even see the last two cards i think it was mother of Rune's shambling vent that's a pretty nice last pick though okay that's insane dude oh he did get the language they need to fix that before modern horizons comes out because that is not reasonable that's not trill um this is my pick because you pick first yeah last time. right that's fine we can just start over for each pack so that it's not I like him, um, especially because we're clearly heavy black. What did you say? I like him. That's what I was leaning towards. Yeah, I think that's good. Everything else over. Because we already have double black, I, double I, black, I like triple explosion black. expansion too, but that's double blue and double red. Right. Yeah, I'll take him. I like it. Man, these are just pretty unexciting first packs. It's okay, we'll get past the mocks here, so. We did not, but that's okay. Dark Ritual is turn uh, turn three Nicobolus. I guess that's God, we could have had Mana Morphos and Dark Ritual. Stop teasing us. And that would literally be it. 
Um, There's also Marsh Flats. Thoughtseize is nice. We don't have anything to get with Marsh Flats, but I, I think it's, it could be fine. <coughs> I do kind of like Thoughtseize. I really yeah. just, I'm just off on like two color fetch lands that only get half your color when you don't have any shocks or duels in that color yet. Right, right. But we could get a Blood Crypt. We could get a uh, Shut up and take my Water right. Grave, you know? Two Elks donated one Trill Buck. <laughs> 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 All right, I'll take Marsh Flats because I think Thoughtseize might come back, but even if it doesn't, it's fine. I think the Ritual or Thoughtseize might come back. Ooh. This is my pick. Yeah. Oh, uh, let's windmill slam that Demir Signet. Yeah, that's that's a spicy boy. That's that's. That There's was, a bunch of cards in that pack that I hope come back too. Yeah, for sure. Oh, I kind of like the Chandra. Yeah, I don't hate it. Yeah. I, I always like that Chandra. Yeah, same. I think the Chandra's good. I think the only other option would be Pack Rat, but... Uh, brain Freeze. And Pith? And Pith? As Rob would say. Torturing me. Well, we got the Demo already. Demo plus Pith. <laughs> and then well, when all we need is the Venmo for Vampiric Tutor. Um, that's, that's not... Uh, is it crazy? I want tomato. I just love Tamiya. I like Mana Confluence here personally. I want some, I want Tamiya. Really, double I blue? I like huh? Mana Confluence. I think Mana Confluence is real good. Uh, mm. ooh, Grave Titan or Colagon's Command here. Ooh, I think I. Th well, I mean, it's your pick. I think K Command. Really, because we have we can go turn to Signet and Chandra. And then we can just go turn four Grave Titan. That's pretty good. I just feel like top end is never a problem. It's like I just want to make sure I nab those interactive like those. Also, we have Goblin Dark Dwellers for K Command, which seems pretty yeah. Good. There you go. All right, I'm game. That, for that. It makes the Dark Dwellers better. Oh, this uh, is Gonti. Yeah, not close. Not even close. Uh, Burst Lightning probably. We just don't have much spotter. No. For Really, over freebooter? I don't like freebooter that much. Like, I feel like it doesn't do a lot. It doesn't do much in combat. It's easy to kill, and like, I mean, I'll take it because I think it's actually fine. But I just, I'm not a big fan of it. I mean, hey, it's you. Okay, you took it. No, like, I mean, I was gonna I'm say that's totally fair. I mean, I, I did a controversial like Tammy over. Conference. Yeah, but I'm not excited about right. burst lightning. I'm not. I, I'm not excited enough about burst lightning to to choose it over. Also, okay, make, so make here I think the pick is. Repeal. Six seconds. Repeal? Yeah, I like, I like Repeal here. I don't know why I don't love Mizzy and Mortars. I think it's just so hard to overload. Oh, the you don't, I don't think you have to, though, because it's just Flame Slash for one more mana. Yeah. I'm going to take the Imperial Blizz Recruiter because I don't yeah. know what we're getting. Uh, right now it gets Freebooter, Ophiomancer, Hymn to Hypnotic Spectre, Thief of Sanity, and Gonti. Okay. And Ravenous Chupacabra. So it actually gets five things right now. Um... Buried Alive or Frosty T? Let's see Frosty T. We have nothing to go with Buried Alive. Okay. But in the future. <laughs> That's a Mike B classic right there. I want to take this Ink Eyes because I think it's actually fine. This is going to be the last... Oh, this is actually... Oh, push. Yeah, 100% push. Now no we get push. we don't get a choice here, so I'll get... I'll, all right, there we go. Wow. That's... Boy, they really... This is a nice update to the program that's really shaving seconds off. This is your pick, Frank. Oh, is it? Oh, are they? Out, am I? I'm something of a scientist myself. <laughs> All right. Um, I like My Arena. Starting to something. I like Spire Bluff just because it exists. But again, then we have two of those stupid lands that come into play tapped. Right. Um, we could splash Fractured Identity off of Marsh Flats, which I think is actually pretty strong. Over Skull Clan. Um, we do have Ophiomancer, but that's pretty much it. I feel like you're always making the argument of like even though it, even if it doesn't kill the creature on the spot, it's just so, such good value. Right, but it's probably gonna come back too. Like the problem is we don't have a ton of creatures, right? Like okay. I usually play it in green decks that make tokens. There's hee haw mouth. I do like hee haw mouth. I'm gonna, I'm gonna what take you... something. I'm probably just gonna take fractured identity. I think it's very good. All right, all right. Well, it deals with enchantments. Oh sure. shoot. What? Your pick. What happened? Oh. Jace. 
Yeah. No, actually, wait. There's a Verdant Catacombs. Oh, come on. Yeah, let's take Jace. Are, are you, were you kidding or not? No, I was I was kidding. I was um, kidding. But I'll we have to... We gotta start prioritizing some. some oh, land for there. sure. If I see them, I'll take them. Hostage taker. Uh, I think it's fine. Yeah. I, mean, right. I don't think it's necromancy. I don't think it's swords. It's not ancient grudge. It's not. I, I do not like that Liliana. Ooh, we did it. I don't know why that Liliana's in the cube. Uh, ooh, watery grave. Yeah, for sure. That's sick. I feel um, like he's got. Why is that Liliana in the cube, but the six mana one isn't? That one's just so much better. Which one was that? The five mana one? Yeah, I don't like the five mana one at all. I'm going to take this Blood Crypt. Yes. I approve. We just took two lands that we can get with Marsh Flats. That's pretty nice. See? What did I say? And you were like, well, I don't know about that. Yeah, um, you're, really, you're, really to you're a really big told you so kind of guy. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. That's My nickname likes... in high school was told you. Wow. Um... This pack sucks. Uh, courtyard's not bad for uh, for fracture. Oh, oh no, courtyard. Yeah, yeah, There's I like only courtyard. Have so many of those lands, but still, whatever. It's better than anything. Else oh, than Goblet that. Shrine. Oh, Mind Twist. Wow. Yikes. Holy crap. No, it has to be Mind Twist. Why yeah. the hell is that? So That's late? a late Mind Twist. We can probably oh get it. My God. I mean, Goblet Shrine would have been amazing, but you can't pass a twist. You can't pass a twist. Uh, I used to dabble in passage twists of myself. <laughs> I'm something of a mind twist myself. You have to be delicate with these guys. These guys are passage twists. That's a late <laughs> castle's judgment. Um, Lava Claw reaches? Yeah, for sure. We're doing I it. don't like Deckard's all at all. I don't either. I think it's actually hot trash. I just don't like the... It's just like they made Chupacabra. It's like the cream of the crop. If you can't kill an artifact or a, or a black creature in the cube, like, uh, just get out. Just get out of my life. I have no I, I have no room for you in my life. This is my pick? Yes. Needle Spires? Phyrexian Arena? Arena could be actually real good. Yeah, we don't really have any good card draw. I like Arena. We have Jace the Mind Sculptor in our deck. We have Nicol Bolas in our deck. We have Chandra in our deck. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, um, <laughs> I can't remember. Can you remind me? I can't remember what I asked for a lecture. Oh, I was just trying to told. I was just trying to told you so. That's all. Mm -hmm. It's your pick. Oh God, Yagwell, no respect. Ms. Merrick Thane, but still. That is an, a, 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 an unreasonably late Yawgmoth's will, yes. It's weird, because I just feel like I didn't see any Storm cards, for the most part, and then... That's why I don't like non-360 cubes. It's like, I just you never know like what you're getting. Exactly, and you're never like, well, what if it's just not in here? Yeah, that's that's my biggest issue as well. Like, I can somebody in chat explain to me how's it, how it works? Like, are, is there an algorithm to make sure that, like, key cards for I combos can't imagine. always get thrown into it like no i can't imagine there is it's splinter twin kiki xr pestermite like that's always going to be in the 360 that's being drafted out of the 700 plus cards that are in the cube what are we cutting here we need one cut maybe repeal maybe kite sail freebooter sailfish comics what's up dude you did pick a good day to tune to the stream necromancy i guess I think this is my pick, right? Yeah, you took the Dimitri pick. thing. Oh, yeah, sorry. I'm looking at the chat now. Your I pick, feel like right? I haven't been acknowledging the chat much. That's hard to Dimitri. do. Dimitri. I did it. I did. That was a thank you for catching the Lebowski reference. I'm not the Lebowski. You're the Lebowski. I'm the dude. I'm or, the dude, man. You know, his royal dudeness or El Dude Arena, if you're not into that whole brevity thing. Uh, Terminate. Yeah, big terms seems very good. I might even play it over Shriek Mall. Yeah, I like that. My friend, I just got a text from my friend uh, saying, hey, you're not going to Manhattan today by any chance. I need to pick something up from the container store. No, no, you did not. I did. <laughs> Seriously? I'll send you a screenshot. Sh 
Should I email his him the coupon that I got? <laughs> All right, let's see how long, let's see how let's see how long we have to take these last two cards. Uh, oh, didn't have a chance. Couldn't even click the card I wanted. Literal impossible to click the card you want. Frank, this should be your next fifteen minute video. It's Just unbelievable, the, dude. You do do a big rant. I can actually do a super cut of all the all the videos that I. Uh... Yeah. All right, we have to make one cut if you agree with this main deck. And then we have notable uh, additions are up here for sideboarding and whatnot. Actually, a pretty good amount of playables in the sideboard here. Yeah. Good, a really solid amount of playables. How, how, what are our lands again? This Frank's identity feels a little greedy to me. Really? We have Marsh Flats, Concealed Courtyard, and a Plains. So we have three white sources. I mean, we could just cut it, but then we also like don't have a reason to play Courtyard. I guess that's fine. Yeah. It it's just, just feels kind of greedy with Bolas. I'm just I'm just looking at the two I, stack each yeah, other. I don't hate that. And then it lets us play. Just then we're good to go. Because because so. because then uh, like the Marsh Flash is so good because it gets two of our dual. It gets the Water Grave and the Blood Crypt. So, so this it's is gonna feel really bad to have to use that to get a Plains, and then like draw Bolas later. Three, four, five, six, seven red sources. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven black sources. Probably go to ten here. And then three, four, five, six, seven blue sources. Oh my god, Kadeen, you're making me hungry. Are you cooking fajitas or something? <laughs> fajitas in the oven. Are you cooking fajitas? Yeah, probably. I would imagine probably. Well, I didn't know if that was like a song you were singing or something. Like Mambo number five. <laughs> Yeah, it's Lou Bega's second hit. It was uh, Fajitas in the Oven. Fajitas, fajitas in the Oven, steak, oven, chicken, chicken, and shrimp. Chicken, shrimp. <laughs> Got a little guacamole on my mind. A little Russian beans is all I need. <laughs> to complete my fajita recipe. Hey, hey, hey. Burr, burr, burr. Yeah, so is this our... <laughs> is this our mana base, you think? Uh, yeah, why not? Because we, we, well, we need one more land. So what do we add? Uh, probably an extra swamp, right? Yeah, I think it is an extra swamp, especially with the... Yeah, this is we're, good. Let's do it. We're a very heavy black deck. Oh, man. That's a good... Yeah, that was some good Lubega there. That just made me really hungry. It's probably uh, Mambo number six, I would imagine. That would be the next... Uh, oh, so we need to add Marari's wig. Un wow. Like, unbelievable. I was. I would have taken the uh, the Jackal pub. It's not relevant. Don't get me wrong. But, I mean, the, the fact jackal? that, like... Jackal? Was it a jackal? The fact that jackal in every up. okay, the fact that in every draft there's three packs that you just can't take a card from, especially because the last draft we would have had Avison, which I, is a relevant card. Yes, I agree. I should file for for redemption on every single draft I've done today. You should. So, we'll you should pick a like, card oh, for I you, Bucks. This card to wheel and it didn't. Or Mr. It did, Crispy, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Uh, I'm going to keep this hand because any blue lets us play Thief. And we have Shonderman. Are you good with that? Yeah. Okay. It's risky, but sure. Is it? I know how, I know how this story ends. I've been watching your stream long enough. Yeah, you're right. You should play Lava Claw Reaches on turn one. No, I'll probably just play Black Cleave Cliffs. What if we draw Kite Cell, though? Well, I'm never going to play this on turn one. I'm always going to play this on turn one. <laughs> I can't... Oh, how... wait, they mulliganed? Oh, that's great. Oh, perfect. Buddy, you can't even draw. Oh, we did it. God, we're so good at nice. this game. Oh, you did play Lava Claw Reaches. Yeah, why would I not? I don't know. For lulls. Did you think I was being serious? Why would I ever not play this on turn For one? For shock laughs? No, I don't believe in that. I don't believe in your laughs. Wow, you sound just like my dad. It's crazy. Wow. Well, I, I don't think I'm screaming nearly enough for that, but... <laughs> oh, yeah. This is... this is we Now we have our we have the pick of the litter here with either Thief of Sanity or Hippie and then into Chandra. I feel like uh, Hippie uh, after a mold of six is going to be pretty oppressive. Yeah, but Thief of Sanity getting them free freebies. I think you're right. I think I'd rather deny them resources than... Uh, it's, it's a toss-up because they both, they're both they both 2-2 flyers that need a hit to do anything relevant. So. 
Ooh, and terminate. Uh, we're set up here. Oh, and they missed a land drop. Yeah, it's not looking good. I wonder if they literally deliberately missed the land drop so they could Library of Alexandria here. That seems so greedy. Oh, they did they miss? Yeah, there you go. They're like, hold on, I hit the wrong one. There we go. <laughs> it does seem extremely greedy. Especially if we just get the... They go to seven. We drop them down to six and... Thank you. Yeah, I guess that's... Jack, and thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Did they... Min oh, they, really? they still no land drop, huh? Wow, really? That's something right there. Well, I think, just, I think you just Sean John here, right? I would imagine so, yeah. Goblin Tinkerer. Welder, whatever his super name is. Can you play the Thick Boy soundbite for me? Damn, boy, he's thick, boy! That's a thick ass boy! Damn! Ba -ba! Done. What are we exiling here? Blood Crypt? Sure, that's fine. I feel like we're way ahead right now, I'm gonna be honest with you. Yeah, it's looking pretty okay from my side of the board. They did not draw a card this turn. Oh, well, that was... Okay. That's... I mean... Oh, yeah, alright, that's fine, I guess. Now we can just mind twist their whole hand away. Look, we got to keep Thief of Sanity. Oh my god, we do get to mind twist their whole hand away. Oh god, vomitous. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We yeah, that's exactly that's exactly. Wow. I mean, we could actually hit with Hypnotic Specter first and keep a Fatal Push Man up, you know, for sure. fun for funsies. You know, for kids. Yep. Interesting. That's the worst sword. I think you should chat him now and be like, "Ooh, if you didn't like that, you're gonna hate this." <laughs> oh, no, this is great because we're we're playing around mana ties. That's true. Karn, Metamorph, Sword of Feast and Famine, two swords. Interesting. I feel like well, they had a welder, so I feel like we're working with a goblin deck here, or uh, an artifact deck here rather. Really, I feel like we're working with a. I just took a bunch of magic cards. And I'm not really sure what to do with them deck. Oh, we could be working with that too. Sure. I just the library. I got some magic cards in my library, life. Like, library and the time twister. The very very strange. Mesmeric fiend could actually be very good here because they don't. It doesn't seem like they have ways to deal with our creatures. Hostage taker seems great. Coligon's command seems great. Yeah. What are we cutting here? Maybe repeal. Wait, sorry. What did you put in? I put in mesmeric fiend because it doesn't seem like they have a ton of removal. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, I like that. I, th actually, I can see cutting repeal. Actually, maybe Fatal Push instead. Well, oh, no, yeah. No. We did see... We saw Goblin Welder. Uh... Yeah, but we also have Terminate and... Yeah, uh, I think that's... Shriek Ma. Like, Goblin Welder is only doing its thing late game. Like, that's yeah, I like that. More... I think that's fine. All right, I, I got a good feeling about this one. Third time's the charm. Um, see, this is tricky. Why is it tricky? Because oh, I want to start with Sheldock, but I also want to be able to him on turn <laughs> two. I, I think, I think, uh... I think we could wait on Sheldock. I think you could, well... Well, we're keeping this hand. Right. Um, let's see, they're going to be on the play. They play a land, they go to five... Like, we can't go him on turn two and Thief on turn three with this hand. We can go him on turn two and then draw a blue source to potentially him on turn... It's a Thief on turn three. Which might happen. Yeah, I think that's fine. I think leading off with this into this. Watergrave? Oh, that's actually pretty decent, right? Kind of. I mean, it doesn't solve our problems, but... No, it's good because it gives us a turn three play anyway. We get to Frexian Arena on turn three oh, right. if we don't yeah. hit a blue. Yeah. So no, it's nice because sure. we do have plays. For sure. We're getting that faux show. Oh, we're playing against Rain Michael. <laughs> wow, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's a Oh my screen. god, they only have two cards in hand now? Ugh. 
Well, let's Give see. Give us a K command after this. Just yeah. good night, nurse. Oh, we can just mine. Oh, Inkle Leviathan Porcelain Legionnaire. That's interesting. Weird. I almost wish that Inkle Leviathan was still in your hand. Lovecrafty it is Elk Tears. It's also in the stream title, so I would assume. Yeah, people would use your to... eyes, Lovecrafty. Use your stupid eyes, God. Ugh. K command one time. Wait, do we? Why do we? One card in hand do now? we care about either of these cards? Not really. Okay, that's pretty good. Yeah, I'm just gonna like play. That. I'm just gonna play Arena here. You think so? Okay. For sure. If we hit any land, we get to play this. You could, have, you could have also just played the tap land and then played Demonic Tutor. What are we gonna tutor for, though? Nickel Bolas. Maybe he can't read. Did you think about that? I have not thought about that actually. <laughs> I have not thought about that. I don't see titles, so. I am title blind. I'm in danger. <laughs> I need an adult! I need an adult! Do you? Nah, I'm fine. Why uh oh. Would you, why would you make that up then? He has white mana. I mean, he had a, an Arid Mesa. He's always had white mana. It was just the white mana was within you the whole time. Cool. Um, I'll let you know if I want a lecture next time. Have okay? you had the Beyond Meat uh, sausages? Yes. They're insane, are they not? Most, I've had most of the. Do we just play Nicol Bolas? Oh no, we can't. I'm dumb. <laughs> we also. Um, oh, we can go. We can go search for him. Well, right. I no, because I was saying earlier, let's search for Nicol Bolas. We could right. though. Yeah, we could go Sherlock. No, or, we, or we just play Chandra. Yeah, I think Chandra is probably better. Of course, we're gonna exile the Nicol Bolas, so that makes me sad. But it makes me sad too. Are you ready for it? Well, best case scenario, they counter the Chandra, so we won't exile our Nicol Bolas. Is that the best case scenario? Oh, Liliana's Triumph? No, I'm good. That's fine. That doesn't even seem that good. Yeah, we should maybe consider taking that out. Uh, I am not a vegan. I am uh, I'm a pseudo-vegetarian. I eat some chicken and some turkey sometimes. But mostly I eat vegetarian cuisine. Uh, I like the Beyond Meats. Impossible is still number one for me. It's insane. Yeah, the Impossible Burgers are nuts. Um... I like Field Roast. Makes really good sausages. I don't like the Field Roast sausages because they, they almost taste like too soy if that makes sense like there's an aftertaste for them for me mm, i just think they grill really nicely i like bring them to like uh, a lot of barbecues and stuff and they just they cook well texture wise they're really close to regular sausages I, I, i'll give you the taste as i feel that way about the new beyond meat the beyond meat sausages those are insane all right what are we doing here i don't know that's a good question. well you got we actually we can play hippie and thief this turn that seems good. That does seem good. A little bit of Chandra in my life. And we can play one of our stupid tap lands. Right. Oh, Gonti, Dark Dwellers, or Mesmeric Fiend. I feel like Dark Dwellers is the play here. Yeah, for... Because uh, we can hit Turok. either him to Torok or Demonic Tutor. Oh, yes, I like that. Do it. We did it. Done deal. Man, Hippie and Thief of Sanity are such amazing 2-2 flyers for three. They're both very good. They are very strong. I I, I only have uh, Hippie in my cube. I'm wondering if I should put Thief of Sanity in. Uh, we actually didn't have enough mana to tutor Bolas and play. We only had three black, and you need four black. I guess we could have played black here, right? We could have played Swamp instead of Sheldock. Right. So then we go black... Uh, black, one of the red, and then we go black, 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 blue, red. Yeah, we could have done that. The problem, but the problem with that line is they still had a bunch of open blue mana, and like we're investing so many resources in a turn to try to cast one. Good lord. <laughs> Good lord. They're really just like going to town with that. Yeah, this hand seems worse. But I guess we have we have lots of advantage on board, so I'm not really concerned with it. Yeah. Trigger, 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 trigger. Like, we have four cards that are going to provide and us And we some... got Tomato. And they're going to Faithless Looting here? I think uh, our opponent is hosting a stream and he's doing an alternating turn strap <laughs> with the, his friend on the phone. <laughs> oh, are they going to name Chandra? Hey, look, Terminate's good now. Yeah. 
Also, we have 22 cards in our deck, so we can actually cast Dark Dwellers next turn. I mean, our graveyard's worse, obviously. Why is Charming Mike not in person? Because that's not how distance works when you live in New York and Florida. Yeah. Let me know, uh, let me know oh. when you... Uh... Oh, we just got to kill their whole hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, we can also oh, call it on command. We got the artifact removal. Oh, oh my boy. God, we, we can we kill can Sword. Oh, this is this is just... Yeah, kill Sword and build Tutor Evoker. Yeah, this is disgusting. And we could also just hit things off of Thief to play. Like, come on. You could just go in Felipe's room and hit him. We could just hit things, just random Felipe's. What do they discard? Last card, Mountain. Uh, Yeah, I'll take a PN Kieran Nalar, sure. Yeah, that's a PN Kieran. Do a playland? Okay, so we have one, two, three, four. We have six mana to work with. I guess Mesmeric Fiend isn't as good here. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Uh, We can just... Did I use this already? Why is... Oh, because they named this guy, so we actually just yeah, have to use you one. You gotta do the K command. Two, uh... three... Two, two uh, to revoke destroy an artifact. Yeah. Sword. Deal two to this idiot. And then we'll just plus for no, for no benefit. Oh, we can just ultimate Chandra next turn. I guess that's pretty good. Yeah, I don't. I don't see what our opponent can draw here. We can just ultimate Chandra. Go mesmeric fiend. Terminate our own creature. Yeah, that seems good. Hey, sorry. Thanks so much to the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. <sighs> We won. I don't think it was even that close. No, I, I don't think... Team Jabra has that. 40 trophies. That's unbelievable. Wow. I haven't even done 40 drafts. How many trophies do you have? I have a mere six. Oh, I see it there. Well, that guy's a grinder. He's grinding. Boy, is he ever a grinder. Oh, this they made, they made an application just about him. I like this. Me too. Let's top deck a Black Lotus. Black Lotus, one hundred percent. That would be my pick. One time, one time, Black Lotus. Us. That's basically the same thing. Now the question is: Arena or Hypnotic Spectre? I think Arena. Really? Well, I guess blue, blue, white. They could have negate. I guess they All could right. have removal for this guy. I don't know. Hypnotic Spectre. It's 50 50. Hippie. I think I'd rather get Hippie countered than, than Phyrexian Arena. Yeah, I agree. Plus, and... Hippie just sets it up so nicely. Oh, that's mean. Yep, that was a good time. That's mean. Everybody wins. Hey, Frank, are you planning on applying to play in the Red Bull Untapped event? Uh, I wasn't planning on it. There you go. There's your answer. There you go. Wow. Frank, uh, what do you think of this uh, the Magic the Gathering animated Netflix series by the Russo brothers? I think it's kind of insane, right? Like, Yeah, that'd be pretty crazy. Well, this hey, is a it's Marsh Flats. That's a blue land if I've ever seen one. I'm just going to arena here. Ideally, they play something we don't care about next turn. God, we're taking one, two, three, four, five, six. We think we go to 12 here. That's good. Basically dead. Do you hate Red Bull? No, I don't really have any. I don't really have any real thoughts on Red Bull one way or the other. What if we draw Liliana's Triumph? That'd be gas, right? Oh, God, that'd be so good. I forgot we had that. My god, this is so much damage. We're basically dead. Watery Grave. Oh, you didn't pay two life there. Nice. Okay. Oh, that's Liliana's Triumph. You're right. It is a Liliana's Triumph. But they do have four mana up. Well, we can just do it during their upkeep, I would imagine. I think we still have to do it. We have to get rid of this guy. Oh, 
I guess you never really counter the tutor, right? You just no, you just counter what they cast. Yeah, exactly. Oh, we could also got Ophiomancer. That would have been good, too. But I guess then we take another four. Yeah, but that still, that still makes us take four. Yeah. I mean, if that matters. Does it? I don't wait, know. you didn't do it during the upkeep. Yeah, I figured I'd wait just in case. They, I'd rather give them a chance to tap out for something else. Are we right. gonna take a six ball again? Give it a shot. Oh, they always... uh, if they have cryptic, it's gonna feel really bad. Mm, doesn't look like it. Spell queller. Oh, this is actually fine though. Because we they can don't have shoot. A... Yeah, we can shoot it and then we get to cast the that actually seems good. I mean we go to we go to six. Oh, they just skipped our combat? Oh, oh man, we are so lucky, dude. Wow. Blessed. That was cool. Hashtag blessed. Hashtag bless you. No shame scoop after that? Wow. That was amazing. All right. Well, they do have two blue up. Well, we can try to hit. Wait. Yeah. Don't we? We can. Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, I like this a lot. Uh, all right. Well, no counter spells were hit this day. Black, black. These guys. Yep. Kill that thing. We could also actually hostage taker that. The spell queller? Yeah, because then we'd still get to cast this, and um, then we'd also get a spell queller underneath, which is pretty sick. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, they have two cards in hand. We have a mind twist. Listen, I, I feel the like prob the problems were fixed. Maybe we take the most luxurious route to get there, but we fixed it. Yeah, this is. That was. Whew. Them skipping combat was pretty clutch. That's six extra arena triggers, my dude. Yeah. What's this? Wrath of God? That was a blowout. Elspeth, Gideon, Jason Mind Sculptor. Cryptic Command, tap your team, bounce arena. Oh, they just treasure cruise there? Oh, that's fine, dude. <laughs> oh, you're good. You're good. <laughs> I'll, I'll allow it. Do you think I have counter magic now? I don't care. Good night, nurse. Is it Mana League? Swords the Plowshares, our guys? Sure. That's drawing sure. me two cards, my man. Sure. Counterspell. They did have a counterspell. They just didn't They didn't have double blue for it. Wow. Love it. And Love sword it. of two swords? What? How many swords have we played against in this one draft? I don't know. I guess you've turned people onto swords. I feel like people generally hate the swords. Well, they're in top deck mode now. Fuck money, what's going on, my dude? Good seeing you, my friend. I, I feel like this deck is going to put our opponents in top deck mode. First. Well, they just played a land. Do they have a flashback? Oh, they just have Angel of Sanctions? Sure. I'll hostage. Oh, Who cares? That's annoying. Is it? Oh, we get a hostage taker. Yeah, like we have it in hand answer. Okay. Don't yell at me. Uh, what? Did I, did I do that? I can has this? I feel like I can has it. Play this guy, play this guy. Next turn we can attack with the snake and these two and draw three. That's true. We we're, we are on a ten turn clock though. Yeah. Yeah, that's a. I mean, that's as good of a top deck as you can ask for, I think. Yeah, I agree. Mm, oh, what's, what's our graveyard? Liliana's try. Oh, demonic tutor is. I mean, they're going to counter it, but... I actually like Triumph here just because they lose their guy. Yeah. I mean, they're going to counter it, but... Uh, Demonic Tutor? Or actually, what if the Demonic Tutor just resolves? I yeah. don't think it would. Whatever. I mean, it's the same as Triumph then, right? Sure. I guess we have no other way to get spells out of a graveyard. I'm thinking, right. Like, if we play... Sword. They're both the I same thing. We stack up with the other deck and think we have Snapcaster in the deck, but we don't. Anyway. But even if they counter if they counter the Demonic Tutor, then it just stays in the graveyard. Wow, they're just right. going to let me cast this? Oh, it's not on the stack yet. Okay. It's not on the stack, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Because now we can, we can attack with Ophiomancer, too, which is great. 
I'm also going to play a land here because there's no reason to keep lands in hand when we have Phyrexian Arena. Smart. Smart. Hey, that's thinking. Hey, that's is, smart. For is you. this game one? Yes. Hmm. It's taking a while. I thought we were dead for a minute, and then we weren't. Oh, Ooh. they stole that guy. That's annoying. Well, they got some pressure on our life total now, that's for sure. Well, not anymore, I guess. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Good night, nurse. And we can play Thief of Sanity. Good night, nurse. Got a goblin dweller in my life. Little bit of zoom do 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 Well, that's pretty good. I feel good about all this, all that's happening. Uh, you're thinking of round one, not game one, dear dad. We won the game. Nice. Uh, I actually kind of like Hex Mage here. It blocks Why? Geist of Saint Draft really well. And I have to assume uh, they have some number of counter spells. Okay. I guess it does block uh, Geist pretty well. I don't know if Fatal Push is going to do much against them. I'll take, take Fatal Push out, I think. Alright, I'm okay with this. Anything else you see that's... No, I like tr Liliana's Triumph for obvious reasons. Yeah, there. very uh, good. Miss Merit? <laughs> Fiend. Missing what? No. No, I like this. Let's run it like this. Alright, I think our deck is strong, so I'm not really... How many Planeswalkers do we have? Nicobolus, Tamio, Chandra, Jace. It's pretty good. I like this. Need some lands, but I like it. I think we're good. Yeah. I'm alright with it. We're also on the draw, so we can hit our mock sapphire. That's basically. We got, a, we got a, a perfect answer for uh for their guys their their guys. For their, guy, the, for their on curve guys, which you know is coming. Yeah, they didn't play a two drop, so that's nice. I'm a big fan of turn three arena into turn four Jace. That's that's a good world to live in. Oh my god, tap out for Geist of Saint Draft. Dang it. Do it. Do it. They Damn. didn't they didn't do it. Do we just run out arena? I think we have to, because then we get to land Jace next turn. Alright. I mean if they we know they have counterspell in the deck, we also know they have mana tithe, but oh, with that just it's... resolved. Oh it did? Whoa, I thought for sure we were getting quelled there. Uh we did not get quelled. That Weird. was What's fascinating. Like I have no idea. Uh, okay, we're good. Gonna... Ooh, Caracas sucks. Why? Well, because they could save their uh, guys. Not if they have to sacrifice. Well, I mean, okay, so they play guys and then they bounce it in response, sure. Yeah. Who cares about that, though? Do we just what? Jace? I don't, I don't understand know. what's going on. Like, they didn't count anything last turn. I'm really I can't. Confused. I mean, I. Do they just not care about the arena? I feel like you counter the arena. I agree. I don't know what's happening. What else can we do? What can we what can we demonic tutor for that'd be good here? Nothing really. Nothing that'd be good here. Just do it. Just play Jace. Alright. Right? It feels right. If they had a counter. You've got to counter this. Oh, that's fine. Oh, yeah. Nobody cares about that. Buddy, I got the troops. You're, just, you're fueling our troops. Oh, they can... Uh, they, they can bounce can, their Venser. A sure. legendary creature. Yeah, that's fine. But then I just block it forever. That's actually a very good combo. I'm a fan of that. I want to draw him to Torok here. Ha <laughs> ha! God! Oh nice. my god. Called it. 
Because now we can Liliana's triumph them. And then we can him to Torok them. Force them to bounce it. We do take two. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. If you, if, wait, stop. I'm going to stop. If you Liliana's triumph, they're going to return to their hand and mm -hmm. then they're going to venture your him back. That's true. We can just him right now then. And then in, re just... in response to them bouncing, we can actually. Yeah, I think you him right now, then they're going to return to their hand to bounce the him, then you can try him. Now let's do that. Black, black. What is this? Oh, is this just spell caller? That's annoying. Is it? I'm getting, I'm getting a little scared for our life total. I think now now you can triumph, right? Yeah, because they either sacrifice the Venser and then they don't get the, the shenanigans, or they sacrifice the Sulqueller and then we get to him them, so. I mean, I think either seems fine. And we just get him back, because they like the, the prospect of this too much, I guess. God, then we got Mind Twist. Wow, Glenlinger, Archmage, and Monastery Mentor? Jeez. Yeah, I think we're in a pretty favored position right now. Well, the problem is, like, next turn they could just bounce Fencer and counter whatever we play. So it's kind of like a lock. Yeah, but if you get under them, like, uh... I think we just keep drawing our lands. We'll eventually, like, have enough mana to... One, two, three, four, five. We have six mana, so we could play Demonic Tutor and, like, Jace. Like, they could just counter Jace. Well, you could, you could Mind Twist for two and then play Demonic Tutor. What does that do, though? You could play Demonic Tutor and see if they uh, respond to it. I just think you should lead off, lead off with the... What's the spell we don't care about getting bounced? I think this is actually fine because if they do let it resolve, we can get an instant speed like a terminate or a Colagon's command. Colagon's command seems pretty good here. Because we have enough to cast it. We can also play Black Cleave Cliffs. I like that a lot, actually. Okay. <laughs> yeah, now we're just going to pass here. And if they just waste their six mana, that's fine. You know, it's really funny. I feel so much more like uh, engaged in a part of the, the gameplay while we stream like this than I did when when I was in person. Interesting, really? Yeah, because I'm just like my face is like right up to the monitor right now. Like I'm, you know, I'm just like seeing every play happening. Oh, that's interesting. Ooh, this is fine. We make them discard their last card. We kill the Venser and then we Chupacabra this. Like that's actually terrible oh yeah for them. oh yeah that's good. I mean the Chupacabra just dies immediately, but. I mean, it's just a term. It's just a four mana terminate, right? Yeah. Disenchant was your last card. I mean, we could also play Jason bounce a Leshnorn. And then mind twist. Oh, one. I like that. I like that better because then we get to save Choops. Yeah. Yeah. It's I like also that just a lot. really funny using mind twist as a Raven's crime. I did it. I chose it. It says choose target creature. Oh, they just they just concede. <laughs> <laughs> oh or o. man, good times, good times. Or O with the Grixis hotness. We're two one two one previously, right? It's pretty good. Yeah. Oh yeah. As soon as they tapped out, I was like, oh, that's the end. Yeah. But yeah. You have one a, card in hand. I would say, given you know the general track record, this has been a pretty good stream. Oh, I agree. I mean, we've broken even every single time. And all our losses You're... were kind of either, like, to, to busted decks or to just, like, mana screw or something, so. Right. Well, how did we lose? Yeah, we lost the first draft in game th three because we couldn't hit our fifth land. 
And then we lost round one in the last draft to a turn two tinker to uh, Inkwell, Inkwell right? Yeah, and I was just like, well, sometimes that's you're just gonna lose to that, I guess. Oh, yeah, it's weird. I feel this sand seems great. Yeah, I like the sand. It's weird. I feel like it's. Um, I mean, I definitely would do it again in a heartbeat. Go back to Florida, but I feel like what it was was like. I just feel like I'm like in the driver's seat here. Like we're both in the driver's seat, kind of, and. Um, in Florida, I feel like I'm farther away from the monitor, and plus you get kind of like close into the your like battle station while you're streaming. Yeah, I think that's fair. I don't know how to really change that dynamic though. I don't think I know. I'm not. I'm not necessarily like really complaining about it. I'm just saying. It sounds like you really have an issue with it. No. Well, I feel like I'm more engaged in like the gameplay here. Where in Florida, I felt like I'm more like commentary. Kind of the, I'm like yeah, commentary, looking at the chat more. Like I barely look at the chat at all. I could see that. Grix is hot mess is my middle name. Wow, that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I did not know that actually. That's good to know about you. Sometimes it do be like that. Sometimes it do be like that. You're right. Is this talk in a cup stream? I don't understand what that means. Uh Is my sound quality bad? It might be because you sound you have a hollowish 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 sound to you, maybe? Uh I see. Got it. Oh, do we just sign it here? It feels like we yeah. sign it here. Oh, and so, uh, as opposed to what? Killing like the keeping up one of these or just tender? I think yeah, Signet's better. Keeping up the chicken tender. I ain't worried about that chicken tender yet. Yeah, you got a, you got a ways to go for this little little hot nugget. Oh, oh. they played a tap land. Yeah, we're they're done. This game's over. Done. I hope they like all three cards and then they don't shuffle and I'm just gonna take them all. Oh, you might say they're gone. T. Gone T. Got them. Maybe you can get him a replay hood with the using the NFL with his own monitor. Chicken tender them out. I'm I'm trying to chicken tender them out, but they're making it difficult. Did they shuffle? What did they do? Uh, they drew. They chose not to shuffle. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh oh. I got bad news for you. Metamorph. That seems better than unexpectedly absent, right? Yeah, for sure. Because this is just whatever they have. This is just the best of whatever they have. What do you got? One? You got one ponder in the graveyard? Was this guy cost seven? I wonder why they did their pile like that. It'd be funny if they needed those lands. I hope they do. Wow, this is a look at this mishmash of. Oh, well. Oh, that sucks. Wow, they hit Dark Dwellers and Frost Titan. Holy smokes! Oh, that's annoying. At least Scanty has Death Touch. I guess there's that. What is D2 um, I could I could see using a removal spell. You want to get Nicobolus? Hippie this turn. Oh, we can get Nicobolus, can't we? Yeah, we can play it next turn because we go blue into blue black, and then we go black black red. Metamorph can't be another Gonzi because he's legendary. So I mean, that just seems pretty rough. Yeah, I like getting Nicobolus a lot. But we can demonic tutor and also just attack, or we can play hypnotic specter. I think. I think I'm just going to attack Ashiok, and if you want to, yeah, but I don't want them to. I guess if they play Goblin Dark Dwellers, I don't really care. Do you... what? What were you gonna say? I think it's Hippie and and. I mean, and then they get to, to do Ponder. Ooh, okay. eh, yeah, but I don't care about that. You Ponder once, big deal. But then you lose your I Ashiok, mean, so. Yeah. Oh wow! Well, if you're not blocking, why why didn't you attack? Right. Well, they probably wanted to consider their options, I guess. I don't know. I feel like you make those decisions when you're in your attack phase the turn before. Um, I'm feeling good about this. Yeah, Nicobola seems good because then we can just kill the... Ashiok? Yeah. More, more like Trashiok, am I right? Right. More like right. You're like, right. That's true. He is, he is correct. Activate land and swing in. Oh, I forgot we even had the Lava Claw Reachers play. I like this line better. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, because then they just block the lava claw reaches and it goes to two. None of this. Banishing light for all your strength. <sighs> okay, well we're windmilling. Oh, uh, Bolus. The problem with Bolus here is that they can just attack it with this guy after we after we kill this because he goes down to one. They attack it with what guy? With a chicken tender. Oh, to, to um, right. Hmm. What else does Bolus do? 
Uh, he gets all loyalty abilities, so we could actually plus to get Ashiok. Did they not? Did they not use this? They did, because because it was at five, and then we hit it to three. Oh, they so they just plus. What did they? What did they hit? They hit arena and two lands. Yeah, that's fine. I guess we could also just kill this. I think that's probably best, right? Just get it out of the way. Yeah. They only have three lands. I think we're actually because our, our way hands ahead pretty here. stacked. Right. Like I think if we can resolve our our things properly, I think we're fine. Uh, currently one deal. Yeah, let's just get the Ashiok out of here. All right, that was good. End of the day, we still spent five mana to get rid of a Planeswalker, and it didn't cost us a card. Did it cost us a card? And I'm saying it didn't. It cost didn't cost us a card. Gotcha. As opposed to playing Bolus, and then we're just running this like out there, right? Bolus. Yeah. Into three mana, only one blue. Yeah, what's the worst that can happen? Nothing. They literally. Do you see how fast that resolved? <laughs> oh my god. Let's draw. I'm not. Oh, we're just gonna. That's the game. This card <laughs> is unbelievable. Like it's hard to cast, but once you get around that, it's just unbelievable. It's funny because I just feel like it's it it's uh Bring in like he didn't need to scoop there, but it just it's um, it just like ignites so much fear. It's like it's like when you land a Jace the Mind Sculptor, right? Where like you don't have to you're not dead on the spot for sure, but you're just watching a long protracted death. Sure. I mean, Vampire Hexmage, right? Seems great. Mesmeric Fiend yeah. could be good again. We didn't see really that much. Like they were kind of stuck on lands. <laughs> we didn't. Um, I don't think you need to bring in Fiend. I do like Hex Mage. I want to keep the push for things like uh, Potato Tender. <laughs> yeah, same. But, <laughs> but how about Repeal? We can cut the Repeal. I yeah, feel like that's like our flex spot for like when we want to bring something in. Yeah, I like it. All right. All right, let's do it, dude. Six zero. Yeah, Nicol Bolas has a real "I am inevitable" Thanos feel to him. <laughs> and I am. Iron. Potato tender. It's so good. Oh man, I need to see that again. I want to keep this hand. What do you think? Yes, yeah, looks fine. Like worst case scenario, we tutor for a land. Whatever. Whatever. Good night, nurse. Oh, underground sea. Wow. Okay. Jealous. That makes our mind twist worse. Our mind twist? Yeah. Why? Because they're gonna draw three eventually. Oh, this makes our... I thought you meant our land. I was like... No, I'm, I meant Ancestral. I'm like, buddy, I don't think you know how Mind Twist works. Yeah, but Chandra makes it... Oh, man. All right. I might just hit a... I might just Demonic Tutor for a land here. Really? Okay. I want to make sure we hit our lands. So we, we, we're we just... We're getting a, a black red land? We can get a black Cleave Cliffs for next turn. Oh, that's cool. And then we don't have to draw it later. And then it's also Chandra mana and... Uh, and then we can Hex Mage if they want to play something nutty. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Thank you. Because if we don't hit a land next turn, then we we could play a card, but then like we're stuck on the next turn. So like it just gets it out of the way. And now we have two lands. Buddy, you're preaching to the choir here. Well, also Freedom playing number eighty nine. Thank you for the uh, subscription. Uh, They've subscribed for twelve months in a row. Yeah, Currently on a twelve month streak. You're doing good. Just Happy read, one year anniversary. Yeah, just read the whole thing. You're doing good. A whole year. Oh, Where is the time gone? You know what? I have no idea, but I'm happy we spent it together. I am too. I'm glad we had these moments together. Today's cons count is 17. <laughs> In exactly seven you're like a, minutes, the time you're like will a be goddamn, 17. You're like the goddamn subscriber meteorologist. Today's con count is 17. Oh, sword with no creature. What's going on with these decks? Nobody cares about this. Oh, wow. That's good, right? Oh, that's a, a great. That's a great. That's a great. <laughs> it's a great god. Oh, fantastic. We're having a good time. Yeah, we'll just... I, I want to... We'll program Elk Tears. We'll get uh, Elk Tears to record the entire English language. 
Uh, and then we can have we can we can make a bot that reads all of the subscribers. I'll be, I'll be like that weird bot that Gabby has on her channel that reads everything. Hey, a whole year. Where has the time got? Yeah, I, I think that thing is so weird. I it's feel so weird. What if someone just like what some troll comes in just like donates five dollars and writes like a curse word? Yeah, sometimes. right. Like, oh, this is we have vampire hex mage for this idiot. Shut up, oh, I love it. But today's, for today's forecast is one buckstorm. Buckstorm. Chicken Buckstorm? Um, what Chicken are we Buckstorm doing here? And I don't care. Well, I want to play Island because two red means we can't play Nicol Bolas, whereas we can play an Island here. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're just trying to kill this Teferi. Yeah. If only Chandra want, could make double black. I want to have that for another turn. No nice. No nice? Is that something you said? No I said, nice. Oh there. nice. No nice. Also, next turn they're gonna before seven p.m. They're gonna go to six. They're gonna play a land, play a spell. They go to four. We can potentially mind twist their hand next turn. Potentially. Theoretically, theoretically. Josh, also thank you for the one buck storm. Really appreciate it, buddy. You are awesome. <clears throat> I don't understand what the sword of uh, feast and famine is doing in the deck. I don't understand what the swords are doing in the deck when they have no creatures. Our hand is pretty stacked against any creature. If they play a creature now and equip it, it's rough. But we do have Liliana's Triumph, so maybe not. Can somebody gift someone a sub right now so I can read, do my sub breathing thing again? Because Or someone fun. can just naturally sub. That's a thing you guys can do as well. Be sure to naturally sub for all your subscriber needs. What is this? Six oh, yeah, mana? Half out for something oh, dumb. biscuits. That's pretty good. Well, we can nick a bolus and kill it. They get to keep three one ones, but and we lose our bolus. Wait, we can. We also have a. Oh, we need it. Wow, we got the wrong lands though. Because nick a bolus is an Elspeth, so we can actually plus nick a bolus right, to, to right. Elspeth. Thank you. Well, that sucks. Josh with the gifted sub. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. Um, Josh BS is gifting one tier, one subs to Frank Laporte's community. They've gifted a total of 204 in this channel. Josh BS gifted like a tier one sub to Rennie S. Rennie S, your continued devotion to the Soul Tide Brood has not gone unnoticed. Today's con count is 18. I'm really wishing this was like Rakdos Return instead. We just mind twist them, right? Like, Yeah. If we play Chandra, yeah. we can play, like, one of these removal spells. No, we can't even. We'd have to do it right now. I think I think we just take this turn, nuke their hand, and hopefully draw black next turn. Delta, Ashiok, Banishing Light, Dark Confidant. Well, it's good they don't have the Banishing Light when we play this Nickel Bullet. Uh, but they can't equip the sword to one of these. Yeah, it's not ideal. But we can still block it with a bunch of Nickel Bullets, boys. Those Nicol Bolas boys are at it again. It'd be cool if the one ones that Nicol Bolas made had like the last attack plating on them. <laughs> That'd be cool. I'm not really concerned about a Wrath effect. I just want to be able to deal with this. Like we we have a Languish in the board, but I don't know if it's worth it against this deck. Maybe it is. What do we discard? No, if anything, if anything, I'd want to bring this Merrick fiend in just to snipe the Elspeth. That was a good card to discard. They didn't do anything here. Blah. Also no blacks. Yikes. I don't think it actually matters at this point. I think we're in pretty bad shape. Oh, wow. They just yeah. counter spell? Oh, they're going to top instead. Sure. Sure. Thank you. Spaghetti Toucher is gifting one tier one subs to Frank Lepore's community. It's their first gift sub in the channel. Spaghetti Toucher gifted a tier one sub to one just isn't. What are you saying right now? One just isn't. Your continued devotion to the Soul Type Brood has not gone unnoticed. Today's cons count is 19. Now, back to Elk Tears with the weather. 
But yeah, Toucher, thank you. Way to way to pop your uh, do, your gift sub cherry. Man, Elspeth is a hell of a drug. Wait, what happened with our our? Uh... I just jaced and I bounced the creature they had equipped. Oh really? Yeah, I just I don't know. Like it's. You I, think wanna, we're... I mean, our Jace is dead. You want to just brainstorm for a uh, the black source? I don't know what we're gonna like. I this is, are we? We're just. I think we're too far behind for this. With that attitude, yeah. Terminate I mean, before the equip is good. Just equip on something else. Like someone said, terminate before equip. I'm just like, if they, if we do that, then they just equip it to another guy. It's not really that big of a deal. It costs them two mana, but then they're just going to get it back when they untap everything anyway. So. I don't see us blocking anything here. I like the news update. Good addition to the stream. Thank you. You like what? I like the news update. Cool nice. Beans subscribed at tier one. They've subscribed for nine months. Cool Beans, read this out loud. <laughs> cool Beans, your That's continued good. devotion to the Soul Tide Brood has not gone unnoticed. Today's cons count is 20. This sucks. I don't like this. I don't I'm like not this having though. a good time. This is a lot of one ones that I'm not really thrilled about. Shell Dock Isle. The pro black is really pro. I'm gonna just go to the next game. You okay with that? Yeah. I don't feel like this is going our way. Do we have any ways to deal with an Elspeth and a Sword of Feast and Famine that we don't currently that we aren't currently employing? I think we're fine on the sword. We got K command. I kind of like Mesmeric Fiend here. I we think, also have I think you want to snipe well. that. Because uh, we didn't really show him a lot of creatures either. So I, I wouldn't be opposed to boarding Fractured Identity in. God, I don't know. Do we want? Do we really want to roll that die on our last game here? I mean, it's an Elspeth. Like, getting rid of an Elspeth with it is is nuts. I know it's really great. My concern is we're like we so couldn't even cast our we couldn't even cast our bolus that game. Right, like, but we're just... not cutting black sources. We're gonna be adding a concealed courtyard, which is basically just a black source. We already have marsh flats and we'd add like one We go we go we're going to ten black sources, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. You gotta risk it for the biscuit, my man. Yeah, I just think we have cards that are good. Why don't you have more okay. good cards then? Try that. Well, so we're not even going to put in Mesmeric Fiend now? Yeah, I think that's good too. Do we care about Fatal right, Push because well, of the Chicken Tender? Cuts. What? I don't think we care about Fatal Push. Like, the only card we saw was Chicken Tender. I guess they have Dark Confidant too. Yeah. What about. Is Liliana's Triumph that good when they have tokens? I guess not. Cut Triumph. Also, we saw Tezzeret, don't forget too. So, Fractured Identity is. Pretty okay, good. fine. Cut, cut Liliana's Triumph. Not Tezzeret, you mean Ashiok? No, they had Tezzeret, did we not? Didn't we Vampiric Hexmage in game two or game one? No, we couldn't have, right? Is that the oh, last you mean round? Teferi. You mean Teferi. Te Teferi is what I meant, yes. Yeah. My bad. No, I guess uh, that was round two, right? Was that round two? No, that was round three. That was the, that was game one. But no, because we, we no, we windmill slammed Vampire Hexmage against it, right? And this is a sideboard. Yeah, round. that was I'm saying that was game one of this round. It couldn't have been yeah. game one because this was in our sideboard. Oh. We board this in. Like we don't have vampire hex page in our Okay, game. so that was the last one. Right, it had to be. Okay, we have we have fifty seconds. What are we taking out? I don't know, man. <laughs> what do I work here? Is Frost Titan any good? I think it's always good. Alright. I just okay. feel like we could win the game without it. But yeah, but I mean you can say that about most cards on our deck. I think we can win the game without Kite Silver Freebooter. Okay, well I mean if that's the thing, then take out Ms. Merrick thing. Okay, I think that's fine. I'm okay with that. Okay. Frosty looks mad, honestly. Cut Frosty. Too oh, late. It's too late now. Wow, this hand is you gas. You guys need to speak up. This hand I like is this gas. Hand a lot. We can save the Marsh Flats if we need the white or if we just want another black for a nickel bolus. So we have a turn two play, a turn three play. This is... And a turn four. This, this curve is just... Just phenomenal. And we're on the play? Get out I, of here. I would have totally played 41 there, just to be clear. So saying play more than 40 is not... Uh, that is not a controversial uh, request yeah, but on this stream. I, so... Here we go. 
I didn't want. I wouldn't want to play. When we're adding like a new <laughs> color, you want to play forty-one. Yeah, I don't care. I just feel like our deck needs to be as tight as possible if we're going to add a fourth color into the mix. Oh, really? You're going to be a lava claw reaches? I don't think we go off curve here. What do you mean? We could actually play lava claw reaches and not play this on turn two, just because I think it's a better removal spell. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, we can do that. I don't think, I don't think we're winning by beating down with Hex Mage. I'd, I'd rather play Hex Mage right after they play it. Now I'm regretting, though, because Black Cliff Cliffs can't come down next turn, so it's going to come down a later turn. Eh, it's rough. Well, we might draw Hypnotic Spectre. One of these lands we're going to come into play tapped, you know, at some point. There's nothing we can do about it. Well, no, though, if we led with this instead of Blood, instead of blood Crypt, though... Then we just have oh, a in hand. See, so see, it's I like see. we just it's poor sequencing, but we didn't attribute we didn't uh consider drawing the lava claw reaches. Oh look at look at this. Look at you. I love when they play this with no creatures, because I'm just like, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, now we're just gonna play Thief. Got Thief into Gonti. Good night, nurse. Oh, they're just gonna be equip their they're gonna equip their thing to this guy? That's pretty rough. Oh, that is rough. One little It was a Jace. Pro black chicken's brutal. That's a that's a black source. I mean we still got to Gonti here. I think that's fine. Yeah. We have a lot of lands to discard. Crack marsh flats manatide. No. Okay. That'd be, that'd be oh sick. wow! Look at this hit. Ugh. This is, a, is this it, is an embarrassment of riches. My God. I feel like it's Frost Titan, right? Or is really? it Factor Fiction? I don't. Or is I think... it Metamorph and make a copy of the sword? Oh, that seems good because we can we can do that in equip next turn. Yeah. Oh, that seems legit. Oh, we're doing that like for that. sure. I like that. Oh yeah, that seems legit. An embarrassment of Richards? Yeah, that's the name of my new Netflix show. That's actually a fantastic name, and that makes me want to write something called the Embar an embarrassment of Richards. Okay, well, why don't you finish this game first, and then we can talk about that. <laughs> Let's do that. We'll workshop embarrassment of Richards. Okay. Ugh, hungry. I got distracted. I never ordered my sushi. This has been good times, man. We should do this more. Uh, do we attack? Do we get in there? Hey, I, I've had a great time. Let's talk about this after the stream. We'll figure something out. But the important thing is, does the chat like it? I, I was afraid this would be like too disorienting for the chat. But I guess like this is something that, like Gabby and LSV used to do all the time, right? Yeah, of course. They, they would just video one of them in. They got Underground Sea? That's real mature. Man, they're going to untap and have five mana. So what we can do is go Metamorph, uh, Sword, Equip, Untap All Our Lands, Vampire Hex Mage, Killed Our Teferi. Wait, do they play Teferi? Well, they're going to. Okay. What are we discarding here? Probably just Island. Over Bla Blackleaf Cliffs? Oh, Blackleaf Cliffs is what I meant, yeah. We want the second blue. I forgot this can only get... Um... I guess it can only get Planes and... Swamp right now, which is fine. Right. And we have bolus mana regardless. There's Teferi. Oh, nice. Let's just hope they have a counter spell. I'm feeling good about this. Same. So wait, wait. I thought I thought that sword untaps all your land. It does. That's how they play Teferi. Oh, because they equip wait. Huh? They equipped the sword to this, untapped their lands, and then they played. Oh, uh, I see. Got it. Got it. Because yeah, they have the. I forgot they have the mox. Yeah. Okay. I was thinking the mox was a land. I'm done. Yeah, I know. Sorry, buddy. Uh, they better not have something here. I don't think they have anything. I'm actually gonna put it on. Put it on Gonti, and then we get a Thief of Sandy hit, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. So then they have to choose. Uh, 
smack your face with both. They have three cards. They have to have a removal spell. Oh, they looks like they got something. But this guy pro black. Oh, condemn the Gonti. That's annoying. That is annoying. Because now they can tuck their own sword. Right. It's, I guess we can get it back though if they do. Well, that that was pretty unexciting. I mean, what are you gonna do? They have to have one mana white removal spell, I guess. <sighs> that was sad. That was annoying. I'm annoyed and sad. I mean, if they tuck this, though, Jeffrey. Should we have just, just hex mage? Oh, and... they tuck our creature. That's fascinating. Uh, I don't think that was greedy, no. I mean, you got to do what you got to do, right? I don't mind them tucking the creature at all because we could just. Like, why are they doing that? You know? Are they doing that to protect their. Okay, well, this lingering souls just got out of hand. Yeah, I feel like we're in bad shape right now. And now we're discarding Island. Fractal Identity could be good, right? Maybe. I think so. Colagon's Command. Ooh, I like that a lot. Because we get, we, we, do we have enough? Uh, we don't have the mana, do we? To cast Hex Mage and K Command. One, two. We uh, if we March Flats for it, we do. Well, let's think. What what do we want to do here? Do we want to just... Uh... We can deal two to Teferi. No, we can actually... Well... Hmm. It's just cards in a graveyard? It's just in sorceries. Okay, so they have, what, yeah. one? Huh. We could actually... I mean, we could Hex Mage kill Teferi. Colagon's Command kill the, the Chicken Tender and the Sword. Which I think is pretty good. No, we can't do that. Why? Because the Sword has protection from black. The sword itself, or the or the, the oh, it the gives creatures. it. Sure, the creature is pro black, so what? When that fizzle the spell, right? Yeah. No, we can just actually ponder here first and see what happens. Yeah, that's what kind of I was thinking. Hostage taker seems pretty okay. I don't think we're shuffling this for sure. No, no, I think we want all these cards. I think we just gotta navigate what the turn's gonna be now. I, I think, think this I think turn this... is gonna be uh we have to do Colagon's command and Vampire Hex Mage. Which makes me wish we shuffled already because now we only get to keep one. That's pretty rough. Like, we have to get rid of Sword and Teferi this turn. Actually we could just Colagon's command. No, we could just K command two to Teferi and kill the sword, and then we have removal spell after removal spell after this. Yeah. I I think that's fine. Right? Yeah. Four. I'll put Choops on the bottom, and then I'll put Hostage Ticket, and then I'll take Thief on top. I will not shuffle. Uh, one, two, three. Destroy this. Shoot this idiot. And this is really like, well, I'll counterspell it. Oh, so, yeah. I okay, okay, noticed cool. the, the four mana they had open this whole time. Oh, okay, good. Well, that's good. Well, so now they just have a bunch of dirty idiots, I guess. I see. I hope we put... I think we put Hostage Taker on the top. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so we can Hostage Taker and then equip it. We're taking three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten if they attack with this. Holy crap. It's a lot. Looks like they might be. No, they're just playing something. Well, that is unfortunate. Oh, no! Well, we're definitely shuffling here because I don't really feel like having them steal our hostage yeah. paper and our chupacabra. God, man, these draws have There been might so have been an argument for... Uh, I that was, that was my, I forgot they had Ashiok. There might have been an argument for drawing the... The hostage drawing, taker. Drawing the hostage taker. I got the water grave instead of the planes, and I'm probably going to regret it, but... Oh, interesting. Well, we can't, we, like, we can't cast Nicol Bolas with planes, but we can't cast Fractured Identity with uh, with water grave. Honestly, so I don't like, think Fractured Identity would really help us that much here. One, two, three. God, this game really turned around. 
I feel like we were in a really commanding position. Hold on, hold on. One, uh, one, two, three. Well, if we had one more mana, we could Thief, Equip, and Hex Mage. But I'm not too worried about the Ashiok. Oh, I see what you're doing. I mean, we'll just get the last card out of their hand here. This is clever. Oh, all our things on tap. This is very clever. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we can just play Hex Mage, kill the. A you don't think you don't think you're not too worried about this? You just want to play Thief Ophiomancer? I I just think I think well, what do we want to do with our mana here? Because I just think we're hundred percent playing Thief. We could actually put Sword on Thief. If we block here, we take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If they pump this, it's pretty bad. Actually, we could Vampire Hex Mage this if they pump it, though, which kind of gives us a nice blocker. Oh, because it takes all the counters off. Well, it doesn't um, give us a nice blocker. They have they one, have flying. two. Oh, I guess it blocks the stern one. Three, four, five, six, seven. They're one away from, actually, they have to hit a land in order to do it, though. So I think we're fine not doing that. But wait, what do they get out of here? They get a Hypnotic Spectre? I don't really want them to have that. And Ophiomancer doesn't block anything, which is my biggest issue. No, yeah. I I think it's either moving the sword to Thief or casting Hex Mage. Are the things we're deciding on. I think it's fine like this. I mean, it's just like, it's... I don't know. Six of one half doesn't, doesn't have another, really. Sure. Because it's going to cost six to activate this, and they only have five, so. And this is the only real profitable attack now. But I guess they can go three, four, five, six, seven, put us to one if we don't want to block the. I guess if they attack with this, it's actually pretty terrible for us, so. Okay. Relax. You're making me very scared. Buck Wild, glad to see you for the first time, buddy. Really appreciate the, the view and the, the appearance. Interesting. You're not going to activate Shambling. Oh, they are. They're just doing it incorrectly because you can't activate it with Island Moxer. But yeah, I think we're dead. I think we're dead here. Here we go. Yep. Ugh. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Boy, my kingdom for a languish and a way to deal with this Restoration Angel in the same turn. <laughs> I just didn't think languish seemed that relevant. It, it doesn't really, like, but I mean, we didn't see lingering souls. <laughs> what do you have, one life? <laughs> Here's a Frexian Arena. Walls. Seems good. Alright, we fought a hard fight. Yeah. I thought we could have trophied this time. We still had fun. Of all the cards in all the world, it had to be Frexian Arena. Hey, listen, we broke even each time. Yeah, I'm fine with it. We got, we got a lot of subs, the cons count went up. We had Thank you guys for watching. We had a lot of laughs, we had a lot of love. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at meundies.com slash Frank Lepore. You get 15% off, along with free shipping and free returns. And as we showed off earlier, they have some sweet Star Wars prints, so you can check those out. Uh, you can also check out manatraders.com. They have awesome Hi. subscription services. Josh VS, thank you so much for the for the gifted subs. Really appreciate it, buddy. You are awesome. Josh, you're great. And um, you. you can get 20% off your first three months of any subscription at manatraders.com by using the link and promo code in the description, so be sure to do that. Thank you guys for watching. Me and Elk Tears are going to get out of here. I'll see you guys next time. We had time. a lot of fun, guys. We we you know I learned something today. He did. Thank you can win your trophies, sure. But having good times with your friends. It's the friends we made along the way. That's the important get, thing. Getting on the stream, making some buds, gifting some subs, being generous. I'm sorry. You can't you can that's priceless. You can't trade a trophy in for that. That's priceless <laughs> and you only get that on Frank's stream. You only get that in the Soul Tide Brood. So thank you for hanging out with us. We've had a great evening with you all. We're going to see you on the next one. My name's Elk Tears. You've been wonderful. Frank Lepore. Welcome to the Frank Lepore Show. Signing off. Have an amazing evening. If you're watching on Twitch, we're not going anywhere. Have a good one, guys. We love you. Take care.